Here he is. I'm gonna hide him. Let me know if you guys find him. I'll put him somewhere. All right, everyone shut your eyes. How's it going, everybody? My name is Finn Pryor. We're back. We're playing Tiny Town. We're building a pizza monster today. Lots of people have requested the pizza monster. Actually, from one of the first videos that I did with these, like, food monsters, someone has said, like, a pizza monster. I've kind of put it off because I thought a pizza monster would be one of the hardest things to build. How do you make a flat disc? You know what I mean? Like, something perfectly flat, like the Earth. How do you make it into a monster? I don't know. I didn't even know how you could do that. Hey, flat Earth. That is something we could also build. <laughs> now, to do a pizza, I thought what I'd do is I'd actually get a pizza from Google Poly. So I've got one of those. Let's find it, because that's what we're going to be using. How I'm going to turn it into a monster, I don't know. I'm probably going to do... I've got this pizza here. Now, that's like a pepperoni pizza. Um, but I've got another one, if I could just find it. Aha! Here it is! Here's a pizza! Alright, we can make this pizza, like, really big or really tiny. Look at this! Imagine if the Ferris wheel was really a pizza. <laughs> I would ride that pizza and I'd enjoy it. I'd be eating it the entire time. Oh, no way. How come this pizza has loads of olives and green crap? I don't know what this is. Is that supposed to be, like, capsicum? Or I guess you guys would call them bell peppers, I suppose. But where's the pineapple? This pizza is lacking pineapple severely. How are we going to turn this into a monster? Maybe I can take some inspiration from some of the other stuff that I've built. I don't know. I've got... Maybe, like, something similar to the way that the burger guys are done. I mean, we could put it, like, upright like this, right? Like it's a monster, and, like, this is its face. Or, it could be like this, and it could be, like, two pizzas. So, if we go like this, right? Like, it could be something like that, maybe? Hang on a sec. Just let me try some stuff. Let's see if we can work this out. Now, where are we gonna put this dude? Um, I reckon... We put it over here, mainly because this is where, like, a lot of the other pizza things are, so the food things are going on. Maybe here. So, it could be, like, if we made it like that. <laughs> it kind of doesn't really look like a pizza. Unless we angle it down this way. I mean, now it looks like a pizza. I don't know how to really turn that into a monster, though. I mean, you could put some arms coming out the side of it. Oh, there's the goat, by the way. <laughs> Here he is. I'm gonna hide him. Let me know if you guys find him. I'll put him somewhere. All right, everyone shut your eyes. Okay, the goat has been hidden somewhere. Where could he be? Ooh, I don't know. He could be somewhere. <laughs> is he in this play equipment? No, he's not. I'm just gonna grab this guy here for a minute. Let me get this dude. Here we go. Because this is a tough looking bikey guy. I'm gonna make him like going down the slide. And he's like, yeah, wee! Let's put his arms up. He's got his feet out like that. <laughs> he's having a good time. Alright, cool. Now, back to the pizza. Um, I'm gonna see if I've got a pizza shop over this way somewhere. I do have a pizza shop. That's the pizza shop. I'm gonna leave that pizza shop there. It could just be a pizza shop all the way over there. I'm going to change this burger shop to a pizza shop. Get out of here, burger shop. All right, let's get a shop. Uh, yeah, this is a shop. Let's put this in. We need to turn snapping on so it can stick to the ground. There we go. All right, it says burgers. That's not right. Get that sign out of here as well. Do we have a sign that says pizzas on it? Can we, like, put something like that out the front? We've got burgers, burgers, coffee. Put a sign here like this. All right, there we go. Sign. We'll grab this. We'll put a pizza on the window. Then, whoa, 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 I grabbed the building. Oops, okay, put the building back. I hate it when I pick up an entire building. All right, put that there. Put that there. Grab another pizza. And we'll put a picture of a pizza right there. Hey, there we go. Pizza shop. All right, and then we'll put, like, pizza like that. 
It's a pizza! <laughs> we need like a little sign or something that says... Actually says the word pizza on it. For now though, that'll do. Okay, I'm gonna leave that there. So we've got our pizza. I reckon we should probably make our pizza guy... Something like this. You know what I mean? Like, they're upright. They're not laying flat or like this, like a burger. I reckon probably upright. Do they have a back on them? They do have a back. That's good. Now let's work out how we can do this pizza. Should we do them small? Or kind of... Oh, I don't know. Yeah, maybe big. Let's do them biggish. And maybe I'll make it so that this pizza looks like he's kind of like smashing up this uh, this petrol station perhaps now he needs to have a face how do you put a face on a pizza maybe like with meatballs they could be his eyeballs so there's already some meatballs so this could kind of work right we'll go like this we'll get some bigger meatballs and we'll put them like there there we go <laughs> oh god that looks so weird white eyes no, that doesn't work at all. Or maybe they could be white still, but they'd be blobs of mozzarella. That would make sense. Okay. Doesn't go through the back. Nope. That's good. And put some other white balls around there. Just so it looks like they kind of fit in a little bit more. Just these little blobs of mozzarella. Yeah. Yeah, that looks good. Okay. And we'll get some black dots. Or even just, um, some, like, little cylinders. That'll do the trick. The problem with the eyes is they're so hard to see. It's really difficult to see. What about if I got, like, a ring, like this? Which, it, this one, it looks like that they use for the, uh... Yeah, look at that! That is so similar. Maybe we'll put them around like this. So they look like they're glasses. Uh, yeah? Kind of works. Big giant olive rings. <laughs> Alright, I think that looks a little bit better doing it that way. So I told you guys, this was going to be the hardest one to do. It's really difficult to make a pizza look like a face. Because there's already so much other stuff on there already. Okay, now we need some kind of mouth. Where did this bar come from? I do not remember downloading this thing at all. I don't know what this is doing as one of my items. Get out of here, bar. Alright, I think I remember getting this motorbike though. I'm gonna put someone on this motorbike. We're gonna have a dude doing like a wheelie getting out of here. There we go, and he's like this. Looking over this way. Alright, there we go, look at that. <laughs> he's doing an awesome wheelie, just getting the heck out of here on his motorbike. That's awesome. Okay, back to the pizza. Now we need to work out some arms and stuff for this pizza. Oh, we still don't even have a mouth. What would be a mouth on a pizza, hey? What do we got? We got bananas. We've got wood. Carrots. Oh, maybe? It needs to be something that kind of stands out so it's obvious what it is. Oh, hang on. Maybe we could use this because it would look like some kind of, like, Vegetable or something like that and this would be his mouth. No, oh, no, we could just try building a mouth out of like cylinders This is something we could do so we go like this right? I hate doing this though because it's like it's really fiddly and it's hard to like line these cylinders up I wish this game had some kind of like drawing mechanism in it You know what I mean kind of like the way that tilt brush does where you can draw like 3d objects You could just like get like a brush and go, and draw like a, you know, an actual tube. <laughs> it kind of works as a mouth. Like, you can sort of see it. It just doesn't... It's not great looking, you know what I mean? If you guys have a, a better idea for a mouth, let me know in the comments. But I have no idea. This is about as good as you can make with what I've got and my brain capacity. <laughs> Alright, let's put that over there. Would he have some teeth? Yeah, he might have some teeth. Is he a bad guy? Maybe. We could give him some spiky teeth. <laughs> okay, once I put the teeth in, that actually looks a bit better. That doesn't look too bad now. 
I think it kind of works. Now I need to come up with some arms and stuff. <laughs> that is so creepy. It is definitely weird looking. All right, I reckon we try and build the arms out of a similar color as the dough. Oh, we don't have any light brown. We've got, we've got one brown shade and that's it. Hang on a sec. So we've got orange. How close is that? It's not too bad. There we go. We'll build some orange arms on him. Ah, uh, no, the, the orange arms, they, they blend in too much. Hang on. Okay, let's put them around like this. Kind of similar to how I did the donut men, really. Because I think those arms kind of worked out all right. They look pretty good. <laughs> okay, there we go. The pizza monster is actually looking pretty good. Uh, let's, like, get a bit of a hand going on. Like, maybe like this. We'll start with that. Okay, cool. And we might even give him some... Maybe some fingers. Can we use, like, something like this to give him fingers? Or give the illusion of fingers. Hey, that actually works pretty well. Look at that. It actually does look a little bit like a hand. And we'll do this side as well. There we go. Make that one a bit bigger so it looks a little bit like a thumb. Stick it on the side like that. Look at that. He's got hands. Oh, that's that's pretty creepy. All right. I'm just going to round out this joint here just to make it look like a bit of a knee. There we go. The knees look a little bit more rounded now. <laughs> he definitely looks like he's like ruined this uh, this fuel station, doesn't he? Actually, I might lay that down like that and then move this stuff up to make it look like he's standing on it. All right, cool, look at that. It looks like he's actually crushed this fuel sign underneath his foot. What's going on with this clown down here? There's a clown that looks like he's turned himself into a suitcase. Look at this, he's folded his, arm, he's, he's folded his arms and legs behind his back in some weird attempt to turn yourself into like a suitcase. There we go, I'll fix that up. Oh no, he's backwards now, wait a minute. Can we rip his head around the other way? No. Okay, can I turn these legs around? Yes, I can. Okay, one is forwards and one's backwards. Hang on. Wait, let's go like that. And then, wait. Put that arm like that, that arm like that. And now he should be fine. There we go. We'll have him here, like, looking at the, uh, the pizza monster. <laughs> he looks a little bit scared. He wouldn't be as scared if he was this big, would he? Whoa, that's too big. <laughs> Just a giant clown in a tiny town. I didn't intend on that rhyming, but that that was perfect. This guy is huge. Okay, let's make him tiny again. Shrink him all the way down into an itty bitty clown. Actually, that's too small. Make him a bit bigger. All right, there it is. We have the pizza monster. Now, I'll probably do one more food monster and then that'll be it for food monsters because food monsters are kind of taking over the city at the moment <laughs> but if you guys have ideas for one more food monster let me know in the comments below and thank you very much for watching this video if you liked it give us one of these ones and i'll see you guys next time <laughs>